Hi, I'm Adam Drake from Mugen Siki Racing, and today I'm going to talk about the new four shoe clutch from Mugen Siki Racing. Okay, so here we have the new four shoe clutch set from Mugen Siki Racing. Um, it comes with all the stuff that's shown. Uh, the only difference is that you actually get four of the 0.8 silver springs and four of the 0.9 black springs. Um, you get four of the hard clutch shoes and here shortly we're also going to have an optional standard shoe which is a little bit softer material. Um, you get the, obviously the four shoe flywheel as well as a clutch nut and a new collet. And the cool thing with this is it uses the same clutch nut and collet as our standard three shoe clutch and it also uses the same diameter clutch bell or our standard clutch bell. You can use either the lightened one or the standard one. Um, but you don't have to get a special bell or a different diameter bell when using this clutch. So out of the box, I recommend using two of the 0.8 springs and two of the 0.9 springs uh, with the standard hard shoes. When the optional softer shoes are available, I would recommend using two of the soft shoes with 0.9 springs and two of the hard shoes with 0.8 springs and uh, that would be for buggy. For truggy, I would still stick with the two soft, two hard shoes, but I would run all four 0.9 springs. And if you're on a really low grip track or you just have an engine that doesn't have a very good power band or is just really erratic, you may want to run all four 0.8 springs. But this is available now at MuganRacing.com. A couple more things that I wanted to mention about the four shoe clutch is kind of the purpose and, and reason for this. So the traditional three shoe clutch works great, provides really good power, um, but it has a little bit more stall before the shoes actually engage. So the power will be a little bit more aggressive. Um, again, if the track's bumpy or low grip, it can be a little bit aggressive and, and hard to drive. Uh, where the four shoe clutch, it engages a little bit earlier and smoother and it's also more tunable by having four shoes and different springs and you can also offset, like I mentioned earlier, between the hard and soft shoes. Um, it's very tunable, um, it provides smoother power and it will also help increase runtime due to not having so much stall before the clutch is engaged. So uh, this is something that I run all the time on my buggy and I'm also starting to run it quite a bit on my truck um, just depends on the track conditions, but again, very tunable, uh, easy to set up, and lasts a really long time.